Ponies make me horny. Oh god. <laughs> Tell me no more. <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Nate and I am your humble narrator. Welcome back to Pokemon Clover. Almost all of my Pokemon are leveled up to level 20 now. We've seen some great changes in some of them, which I will review shortly. But first I gotta use a rare candy because Gremlin has just been dragging ass. So, uh, there. Now... Oh god. I gave it to the wrong one. It was used on Kim. <sighs> oh well, can't take that shit back. Kim has changed, as you might have seen. She's now, uh, a gangster hamster kind of thing. And instead of tackle, she has slash, which is super fucking cool. Gremlin, really dragon ass, uh, struggling to hold her place on the team, but... For now, whatever, it's fine, I guess. Kim, nice jolly nature, gamster. So yeah, um, I'm really digging, digging how this one's turning out, especially with Slash, Slash and Hal put together uh, with a high crit ratio. I think she could do some major damage. Uh, Mr. Douglas, Ano Gi, I don't think he's learned anything new. Oh, he learned Magnitude. I got rid of uh, Vine Whip in favor of that. Keck, yes, he's learned Fake Out, which uh, isn't that much of a change. Pecker, we saw, has evolved, but also has learned Wing Attack. Pretty cool. Decker, also evolved. My goodness, so many evolutions on this trip to 20. So, uh, it makes me think maybe I shouldn't have grounded out off camera, but that shit would be boring on camera. Let's be honest with each other. So, uh, Decker now has Roll Out instead of Tackle. Or was it Horn Attack? Yeah. He got rid of Horn Attack and gave it Rollout, so a bit of redundant coverage there, but maybe something good will come of it. So I'm gonna keep Gremlin in the front. She's got some leveling to do because I fucked up with my rare candy. Gamster jumped out and was like, gives me that shit, and grabbed the rare candy up. So uh, sorry Gremlin, that's just how it goes sometimes. We're gonna try and fight this fucking dude again. You wanna be the best? Yeah, I, I do. It, it, it went real bad last time when I was trying to be the best, but hopefully this time it's gonna be awesome. Lifter Greg, here he comes with his fucking Armando, and it knows a bunch of fighting type moves, so I'm just gonna stay out here and uh, shoot acid at it. Shoot acid in its face. I could also probably bring in Pecker and uh, end this fight extremely quickly, but that ain't what I'm gonna do. My pokes are nice and strong now. Able to take that karate chop pretty easily. I think we were around level 15 the last time we fought this dude, so, um, yeah. Significantly stronger now. Although he's still taking me down to half health. I guess that's fine. He's gonna go down to the acid attacks. Ooh, suck on that! And, uh, get some of that sweet, sweet EXP. Charagon. This is not gonna be a nice thing. I'll go ahead and switch out into Decker. Let's see if we can get some magnitudes going. Magnitude 8, magnitude 9, who knows? It's it's a mystery around here. He's got that flame charge, his one and only attack from what I remember. So uh, yeah, he can go ahead and speed himself up all he wants. That's not Decker's game. Decker's like, slow and steady wins the race, Bo. So we'll go ahead and smack him with a magnitude, as long as uh, we don't get fucked up by that smoke screen, which totally happens sometimes. Look at that magnitude 9, just like I wanted. Super. Awesome. Your whole village is crushed. You're done, kid. Buried under a pile of rubble. So there we go. And, uh, quickly, quite quickly as a matter of fact, we are back to this thing, the Reptike, which has arm thrust, ice, thunder, and fire punches, which is really, really interesting. I assume it's a, a fighting type of some sort. I'm gonna go ahead and mud slap it just a little bit so I can get my flying type in here and we can give that thing a wing attack to the face and hopefully that's just gonna be the end of it. So he's going for the arm thrusts now. I think Pecker's gonna be able to live through a set of arm thrusts at least enough to uh, get the wing attack and take him down. He misses his fire punch as well which is really really nice. But we'll see what a wing attack do. <gasps> Yeah, it's super effective. This guy definitely has a bunch of fighting types. Fire Punch, not gonna do much on uh, Pecker. Which is interesting, he has the Thunder and Ice Punch, which are super effective, but he ended up going for Fire Punch. 
I guess I'll just thank my lucky stars. He heals up a little bit with a berry, but it's too late. My training overcame your shit, Greg. Now get out of here, Greg. Fuck off. Awesome. Keep going, champ. Yeah, I mean, thanks. Kinda. You kicked my ass once. But I guess that's how we get to new heights, isn't it? That's how we discover new things about ourselves. Oh, hello. Howdy. I saw the way you whipped them other trainers back there. My name's Kimmy, and I'm a pretty sharp trainer myself. How's about we have a battle, and if you win, I'll invite you to my secret club. Ready? Let's go. He, he didn't even wait for me to say, never mind. Yeah, I'll go to your club. I'll win, and then I'll go to your club, and I'll take over the club. Me Meme-ness? Oh my god, meme-menace. Meme-menace. It's the evolved form of Mei Mei. Definitely. Um, probably a normal type, so I'll stay in here and shoot some acid. But it goes straight for the fake out. That's not nice. I hate that fake out. All these memes have fake outs on them. I don't understand that. But it is only level 15. I'm still gonna go ahead and switch. I'll go ahead and switch into Decker. That'll be nice. I just don't want Gremlin to die. I want her to soak up the XP at the front of the party and hopefully, uh, make something of herself. I didn't have a lot of hope for these other dudes until, until they started evolving. Like, uh, Kim was really lagging behind, but now that she's evolved... Oh my god. Water Pulse. Gotta watch out for that. I'm locked into rollout now, so, uh, we're just gonna play it out, see how it goes. Another water pulse! Ugh. But yeah, Kim has uh, become quite a badass now that she's all evolved up and shit like that. And yeah, they do evolve at relatively low levels, so that's nice. She's at her maximum power now and should carry us for just a little bit further. Oh, look at that no goat! It's like a superhero goat or something. It's also uh, gonna bulldoze the shit out of me. That's not nice. Oh! <coughs> Pardon me. I knew that was going to be super effective, but uh, I didn't expect it to kill me. I thought Decker had some, some nice defense, but apparently not nice enough. I'll switch into Gremlin. I'm going to lure the ground attack and see if it'll go for that while I switch into Pecker. Is that going to work? We'll find out. We shall find out. I hope it does. Yeah, there it is. Ha ha ha. You were fooled. You were fooled and you didn't even know it. So their uh, wing attack, unfortunately not doing much with the wing attack. Rough skin, I thank goodness. Because of the rough skin, my next wing attack is going to be able to KO that thing. This thing's pretty tough. She is a, a top tier trainer, as she said. Here's no negative. No negative. Negative, no. Hmm, it's only level 17 though. I mean, we should be able to do some shit against it. Let's get Douglas in there. Let's see what Douglas can do. Alright, go for it, bro. Charming Cry. Oh, it's a new move. I've never heard of that move before. We've got Magnitude, so I guess uh, I'll see if it has an electric typing to it. That seems like a, a sound plan. That Charming Cry is really uh, hurdy, but I should be able to live one more. And Magnitude was not super effective, but it was a critical hit, so I guess I'll take that. Charming Cry, live one more. There we go. Bullet Seeds, KO. Here we go. Didn't even need two hits. Wonderfully done. Good job, Douglas. That's why you're my boy. Douglas. Doug Funny, Douglas. Oh, you're as good as I reckoned. Well, look at me. Look at me, bro. I'm fucking yoked. My club's having a meeting down at Triport City later. Hope to see you there. Toodles! Okay, bye. See you later. Cool. I'm sure we're totally done with this and there's not going to be a surprise battle at the end or anything. I need to heal up probably anyways. Just because I'm uh, low on health, not because I think that that, that uh, Jew's going to pop out of the, the woodwork and try and attack me or something. Try and take my gold nuggets. You know how that goes? Happens all the time, dude. Happens all the time. Way more often than you think. You just gotta watch yourself. That's all I'm saying. Alright, so let's see how it goes. Everybody's all healed up. 
Grimlene is in the lead because she's uh, lagging behind because her trainer's a derp. Uh oh, I'll let you join my group for a small fee. Oh, Mazel Tov, friend. That, what a generous offer. Merchant Goldberg wants to battle. Sent out Chomp, Chomp, Chompest, Chompest, Chomp Chest. You know, that thing. That thing that's rock type. And that's all we really know about it. So, if it's rock type, I've got something to deal with that, don't I? Surely, surely Douglas will do. That's how we do around here. What's that you? Camouflage? Mmm, yeah. Transformed into the normal type. Oh, that's, that's fine, I guess. I'll go Bullet Seed. Bullet Seed. Because 25 power hitting 2 to 5 times is better than Vine Whip, which was 40 power and only hits once. So even if you're just hitting the basic with Bullet Seed, it's going to do better than Vine Whip. That's, that's basic maths, dude. You can go to the moon on maths like that. So hopefully this thing's not going to fucking use takedown again. Because that was really quite hurtful. Oh, and there it goes again. Of course. Every time. Every fucking time. Um, magnitude or bite? Or more bullet seed? I guess he, or, we can't go wrong with bullet seed. We'll just take that thing down. But yeah, Douglas had quite a time with that. Everything here is level 20. I don't understand. Why am I so weak? Oh, I just wanted to be the very best. And he's got a Chan Truth. Oh my god, what is that? It's definitely uh, related to a merchant. But I... I don't know what it's supposed to be. Well, he used Payday. Which is a normal type move, I think. But, um... Doesn't tell me much else. No, indeed. Let's see what Gremlin can do. I just want to keep her ahead of the game. Snatch. Waits for its foe to make a move. Uh-oh. How about some acid? Oh, that seemed to work relatively okay. A little more payday. Hopefully I'm going to be the one collecting these payday coins. Coins are scattered everywhere. I can't believe he doesn't just like stop in the middle of the fight to collect the coins. Because that would be fitting. Do you see? For a merchant? Hmm... I did get the uh, spec D drop, so hopefully this acid's going to be hurting more and more as the fight goes on. And here comes a payback, which is going to do half damage because he's moving before I am. But it's still, uh, still not a move I really want to take to the face again. And thief, ooh, he thiefed my life. That's what he did. Um, okay, I guess I guess Keck is going to go out there. Probably it's dark type. We need to use some bug bite. Some bug bitings. That's that's what I'm putting my money on. Although two of my Pokemon are down already. It's a good thing I healed, or I would be uh, totally fucked once more. Ugh, this game's just so hard. Level 22? I just power leveled, bro. How are you gonna be higher than me when I just power leveled? What the fuck is happening? Well, either way it goes down. Keck got a shit ton of experience from it too. Oi V! It's like another show up! <laughs> hey, so uh, what about the club? Now how am I gonna get more shekels? I don't know. Stand on the bridge. Wait for the grumpy old troll. Oh wait, that's you. You're the grumpy old troll, ain't ya? I got it all figured out now. Wonderful! Hey! That's wonderful! Alright. So get my heels up. Because I got a couple Pokemon that went down. I didn't expect them to go down, but they did. Everything around here is just so strong. I mean, how can you Nuzlocke this game? I didn't know it would be this hard going into it, but uh, yeah. The difficulty is fucking cranked. Cranked, dude! Whoa, Christmas with the cranks. Then we got some snow over here. That's pretty cool. And I set a lady. She's lurking. I want to go see, like, what's going on up here. Hello. I'm having a little snack here. How about a battle? I mean, you, you having a picnic in the snow? It's not a good idea. You're going to get hypothermia. You're going to die of pneumonia. Something like that. Back up. Back up. Hmm. What is this thing? Ground type? 
looks kind of ground typey to me. I can never be too sure. Let's try Pecker. I think the the idea is to uh, go offensively. See, because I just gave him a free switch and he got like a free takedown on my on my Pecker. Took my Pecker right down. <laughs> it was up and now it's down. Well, it's gonna be okay. I can live through another one. He's got that recoil damage, he's got that rough skin. Should take him out with a wing attack this time around. Shazoom! Alright, that's how we do it. And uh, level? No, not quite. And here comes a Peacotton. I know it's got some uh, electrical attacks and whatnot. And I also know that it's fairy type, so I'm gonna switch back into Gremlin. You, you Gremlin and Pekka, you could share this XP, alright? You guys could be good friends forever. And it just seems to be using quick attack, which I guess is okay. Better than the sh thunder shock I was expecting. So here comes the acids. The acids! And uh, I should be able to KO it before my gremlin falls asleep, I do think. It's gonna fall asleep on the next turn because Peacock and use yawn, but that's okay. I'm gonna roll the dice on this one. I mean, even if I didn't KO it, like, I would just wait for Gremlin to wake up and, what, take a couple extra quick attacks to the face? Like, who gives a shit, really? Gremlin's a tank, but that also means she's super hard to level. Thanks for entertainment! Uh, y you're welcome. Enjoy your snack. I'm glad we could have, uh, this lovely exchange on a snowy mountaintop. Mmm, I'll switch Douglas to the front. Gonna be backed up by Decker. Kim and Pecker are uh, already level 21. Oh, here's a berry tree. Citrus berry? Aspier. Uh, Asp Asperger syndrome berry. Eat this and it'll make you super smart but super weird. Too late. Too late, kid. Oh, look at this frost owl. That's pretty cool. Ice and flying type. Reminds me of like Articuno or something like that. He's got snow warning. I don't need that. I don't need it, I don't want it. I mean, I kind of want it, but I don't need it. That's for sure. Here's another route. Hey, what are you doing over here? Pinkie Pie's the best pwn. No, that's party. Oh God, it's a brownie. Uh, hello there, friend. Neckbeard Pinky wants to battle. Yeah. I'm just gonna take your money and be on my way. In between? Hmm. I don't really, I don't really get it 100%. Is this a pony reference that I'm not really getting? Doesn't matter. Bullet seeds. Bullet seeds everywhere. At least it's not shooting ice at me. I guess I'll be grateful for that. That bullet seed's doing pretty good damage. Moody made special attack rise, accuracy fall. Oh, it's got Moody. Ooh, that's a really good abil ability. A moody bidoof? Ooh, that, that shit will fuck you up, dude. Guaranteed. They had to ban that shit in competitive play. I forgot it was even an ability because uh, people aren't allowed to use it. Euphoriel, and it's a fucking fedora. That's pretty funny. It's a UFO fedora, and... Uh, I don't know, maybe it's ice type. It looks like it's got some icicles or something hanging down off it. Let's see what Bullet Seed gonna do. Well, it definitely doesn't do as much damage as it did to uh, Pony Pie over there, but that's okay. Still gonna be enough, enough to take it down. Oh, and he's tormenting me, which means I can't use Bullet Seed twice in a row after the torment. Damn. So I guess I'll switch into... Magnitude's not gonna work. That thing is clearly off the ground. Maybe I can fight it, though. Maybe that'll work. I don't know. How about, uh... Yeah, it's, it's not great. I gotta go beat my dog. Oh, I get it. You for real. Are you for real? Bro? You, you really like my little pony? Is that a thing? Well, this thing's gonna KO uh, Douglas in almost no time at all. I'm gonna switch to Kim. She's my fucking pinch hitter. Got that slash. And uh, that's a really hilarious sound when she comes out as well. Air horn. 
So I'll go ahead and slash that shit up. Done. Got him. And uh, my daughter's talking in her sleep, which is fun. Fun for everyone. Got a dog, got a daughter. <laughs> Ponies make me horny. Oh god. <laughs> Tell me no more. You for real? Oh, I can only wonder what lies beyond in this snowy landscape. It makes me euphoric. Euphoric. Only once I know the truth can I become truly euphoric. Mount Clover ahead. Oh god. Maybe I should go in the gym. Maybe I should open this box. It's a calcium. Delicious calcium. Helps to build strong bones. Oh, and we got a nerd over here. Hey nerd. What are you doing, bruh? I'll defeat you for the honor of my waifus. You have you have multiple waifus? Are they not upset about that? Meet Paul. Hey Paul. It's a cheeseetta. Oh wow. It's made of cheese. I'll go ahead and fake that shit out. Baboosh. And it's pretty tanky. How about a uh, bug bite? Do bugs like cheese? No. Bugs vomit and die to cheese. Oh my god, it's fire type. Holy shit. That's not good. Pull out. Pull out. Come back. Get out there, Decker. Save, save Kekroach from a fiery doom. And here comes the charm. Attack falls. This is not good. Maybe roll out. Roll out could do some shit. It's not gonna start that strong. But eventually, it's gonna get super powerful. Unless I get keep getting fucking charmed. Stop that shit. Come on, man. Ugh. Frustration. Well. It's, uh, not going the way I wanted to, but that's okay. As long as we can KO it, I guess, uh, that's all I really want. And here comes a sweet kiss. Is that confusion? Yes, it is. Fart. Well, at least if I hit myself, my attack is super low, so it's not gonna hurt that bad. That. That's fine. Flame burst, I can handle that as well. Oh, boy. How about Mud Slap? Do we just break through confusion enough for a little mud slap? Nope. Damn it. Damn it! Fucking frustrating Pokemons everywhere I go! Come on, snap out of confusion. Little mud slap. There you go. Hey, buddy! Now you're doing some shit. What a weird sound that made, too. It's like a, a really watery cheese drop. Bloop, bloop! Cat grew to level 21. That's pretty nice. Decker needs to switch out of here. And there's Titai. Titai is like a cross between tits and hentai. Is that... Am I following? Am I tracking correctly? Let's get Kim out there. She can cut off tentacles, cut off titties, whatever you want to do. She got a titty hanging out at the MTV Music Awards or something like that. Jesus, that was like a long time ago. But this still happened! I still kinda remember it. Drain kiss? Ooh. That's not gonna be good. I need to get a fucking crit on this thing. Come on! Crit it up! Oh my god, what is with the sweet kiss? All of her Pokemon know sweet kiss? Not cool. Not fucking cool. Alright, I'll get Gremlin in here. We'll finish this shit off. Finish this shit off right! More drain kiss. Hopefully she gets the liquid ooze, and then uh, she'll just die. Fall dead. There it is. Yeah! Sucked up the liquid ooze! Sucker! I had a plan this whole time, you didn't even know. How's that, son? And there's a mud pants. It's got the sand stream. Oh boy. What do I have for mud pants? Is, is Douglas still okay? How is Douglas's health? I don't think it's great. Everybody's looking in pretty shit health at the moment, but uh We gotta do what we gotta do I suppose Hopefully Douglas will survive the switch in. I'll give him a super potion if that's if that's gonna help things Fury cutter. Oh, that's that's bad That's how that went. Okay. How about pecker? Pecker might you do this for me a bit of wing attackage 
might help just a bit. And uh, Pecker's buffeted by the sandstorm. Oh, I'm not liking this at all. But that's okay. We got uh, plenty of Pokemon to put plenty of damage on this nasty little thing. This nasty little shit monster. And eat that rough skin, that's right. Mmm, delicious crispy skin. <laughs> and critical health, but that's okay. It's too late for this thing. Go down. Be dead. Die now. <laughs> it's such a foul sound it makes too. When it dies. Or comes out. Or does anything. It's like a diarrhea fart. My waifus! No! Yep, sorry bro. Had to be this way. I gotta go back to the Pokemon Center. We will explore this uh, this landscape a bit further in another episode. But uh, for now, yeah. My Pokemans, they needs the healing. You understand? That's how that goes. So, this has been Pokemon Clover, friends. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I sincerely hope that you enjoyed the episode. If you did, I hope you'll like, comment, and or subscribe. We'll find Tumblrita at some point and uh, make her cry. And then also Mount Clover, which I'm not looking forward to exploring another mountain anytime soon, but it must be done, so we shall do it. Anyways, I hope you'll join me for it. Thank you so much for watching, friends. Until the next time, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.